Hi friends! So today I decided to make a video of me drawing. I'm not really very good at drawing but I've become very interested recently. I've been drawing on my phone using Autodesk Sketchbook. I've been using a stylus that I bought from Daiso. It's a universal stylus so it works on all devices because the Apple Pen is really expensive and I don't know if it'll work on my phone. Anyway, the stylus is uh, its really small, but somehow it aided me in drawing. And recently, my friend also uh, gifted me a new stylus. It's really cute. It's pink and it's glittery and it's longer than the one I have. So I, I was really encouraged to draw more. Uh, so far, the things I've been drawing are uh, anime characters that I currently love. Currently, I am obsessed with Boku no Hero Academia and because of that, I drew three of the characters. Here are the samples. Midoriya, Uraraka, and Bakugo. And I'm working on Shoto. Shoto is actually one of my favorite characters, but I can't really draw him right now because I'm not really inspired. Anyway, our block actually had an exchange gift and one of the things that I wrote on my wish list was watercolor pencils. It's because I wanted to draw on pen and paper now instead of digitally doing it. I just felt like uh, I wanted to try something new. I don't know. I received it from a friend of mine as well And one friend also suggested that why not make uh, something for him because he's the one who gave me the, the Watercolor pencils and so I thought yeah because we're close uh, I'll be drawing him in chibi form and With the things that I remember him by hence this video one of the many things that I forgot before doing this was think of a color palette. So I randomly picked colors that I think were cute or pretty and I used them. So what I did first was I drafted a random drawing and as I'm not really very familiar with using watercolor pencils, I tried them on my drawing. But unfortunately, it didn't really end well. <laughs> It was far from what I have expected because I wanted to do like gradient thingies although I'm not really familiar with that too so I just settled with what I finished and so I proceeded to outline the paper so that I could see its center and then actually drawing what I had in mind. So the first drawing goes to Chris playing the piano. I had a really tough time doing the hands because, as I said, I'm not really very familiar with a lot of things. But I think I managed. I tried my best to portray the hands when you play the piano. And so, cue time lapse. And also, I incorporated flowers to my work and plants I don't really know of. They just bring color. And because of the colors that I picked, they really match the ones that I drew. So, yep. From now on, I will be drawing flowers for the background. <laughs> okay, for the second drawing, I wanted Chris to hold a lunchbox. Because that's what one of the things that I remember him by. I kept repeating the same mistake over and over again because I can't match the size of the first drawing to the next. But eventually, after multiple erasures and frustrations, I think they matched. It's a little bigger than the first one, but I think it'll do. Now, off to coloring. Actually, for the coloring, I stopped recording for a while because it might take too much of my memory so I just skipped it and this is what I came up with you may think it's not impressive at the moment but when I put on water it's still not impressive <laughs> so I applied the water with a brush a watercolor brush but I did it off cam as well because of the memory you know 
So anyway, this is what I came up with, and I'm now I am going to outline it with a tech pen. Tech pen? I don't know if it's a tech pen, but it's a pen. I think that it looked really bare so I wrote down some captions in Hangul just because I wanted to. <laughs> I don't know what to caption but I wanted to write something. So it's Piano Chris for the first one and the next one is Chan Mo Ni Tang. They do the the ng sound at the last bit of every word that ends with a vowel to make it sound cute. I think it's cute. Chan Mo Ni Tang. I'm not really very imaginative nor creative because I just started uh, taking interest in drawing and I think uh, if I if I practice a lot from now on I think I'll improve I hope so it's really simple I don't know why I did a video of this but I just wanted to commemorate the first time I ever drew on pen and paper and colored it I'm just really happy um, that's it. That's it for this video. Thank you for watching and...